Most people live their whole lives having never imagined what it would be like to not have the ability to stand up or have the full functionality of your legs to reach things in a grocery store or what it would be like to come home and carry them in afterwards. And for those people who live their lives in electric wheelchairs, even the most mundane of tasks can be quite arduous. But with a little bit of hard work, determination, and technology, these tasks have become easily surmountable. There is always the risk of running out of batteries on the way to the grocery store, in which case a good Samaritan is always necessary. Because the world we have is simply not designed for people who get around in wheelchairs. In the day and age we have with such technology, it is only natural that somebody who lives in a wheelchair and gets around in one might have a different perspective on an idea that could help a whole lot of people. Now there was no real brainstorm thing that really gave me the idea right off the bat. It's just little by little you start saying, geez, you know, if I had a remote wheelchair... That's right, and more specifically, an attachment for an electric wheelchair that will allow any electric wheelchair to be controlled remotely by either your smartphone or remote control, or on another model, your smartphone and a backup remote control. Yeah, smartphones are a little little above me. This is much easier for, for me. Now, if you were younger and into the smartphones, I'm sure the smartphone application would work just great for you. Okay, so we're going to demonstrate a remote control wheelchair uh, that my nephew has designed and come up with because uh, there's a lot of situations where I need the wheelchair to either be moved away from me or bring it up to me or bring it to me from where I am. Darren worked on it little by little and this is what we've come up with so far. All right. Now this is a main magnet here and this is a main magnet here which goes to here and right here. And they practically pull them right out of your hand, they snap on so well. Now these are the control arms, which there are magnets in our little rubber control piece here. And that snaps right on there. And then this one will snap, see how it pulls it right out of my hand. Now these are little servo servos and they control the joystick. I might have this one off. It at least looks better. Now we're going to get out our control unit. Now you can see this is off. All right, so now we turn on our control. So now you have that on, and the wheelchair is off. Oh, yeah, right. And the receiver has a separate on off button underneath this, this armrest. I put it under I'll here. Switch on, and the arms move. And now you can turn this on by just pushing this joystick and the lights are blinking so now your wheelchair is on and then you're good to go and this is a great setup and that is very basic very basic and very uh, simple to do we did a little video on mowing the lawn and that is a great uh, application for it and this is a really very uh, simple setup transfer board in my chair in case I need it now I want to change the oil in the tractor so I can't go around it in here in my wheelchair. So I'm going to move the tractor out into the driveway. And then we're going to bring the wheelchair out to the tractor. Okay, so now that we're out here in the driveway, I'm going to bring the wheelchair out to us. <laughs> I'm going the wrong way. Alright, alright. Alright, so now let's... And there we go. Now we're in our wheelchair. We got our tractor out in the yard. Where, if we want to change the oil, we can get at it. Because we have a remote control on the wheelchair, and we can bring the tractor out of the garage so we can get all the way around it. And now that we're out in the open, then we can come up and open the hood. 
And then the oil filter is right there. And if I had my oil filter wrench right now, which you, you can do, to go get in the garage, I could reach down, open the, take off the oil filter, and I can change the oil on the tractor by myself without any help. And your alternative, if you didn't have a remote control on your wheelchair, would be what? I'd have to have somebody come and help me do this. And so that's a big deal. So I can do it on my own. So that's, that's really improves life when you can do things for yourself. And just to show people, um, a lot of times the wheelchairs, if you don't use them, if you don't move the joystick uh, for too long a time, they'll power off. Yeah. So All of them do. All the wheelchairs, if you leave the power on, they will automatically shut off by themselves after a certain amount of time. So we have this program that even though if the wheelchair shuts off, it's all we have to do is move this lever and it'll turn the wheelchair back on and then your remote control will work. Because without any power you can't go anywhere. And then the other part of the design we have is it's all kind of locked together with magnets. So you kind of pull them apart and you can pull them out of the way and they just fold out of your way so you can pilot it manually. And then you can go back to the way your normal wheelchair is. All you have to do is turn it on right here and then use your joystick just like you would normally. And that's pretty, uh, pretty neat. And if you're out mowing the lawn, what you do, and you run out of gas? <laughs> your, your tractor runs out of gas, but you're not stuck because your wheelchair has a remote control and you can bring the wheelchair out to you wherever you stopped in your yard, which is great. And there we go. Gas within uh, how many, how, what's the distance you think this would work? They say it's about 400 feet. 400 feet, and that's quite a distance. You could be out of gas a long way away. Uh, size small yard, you would be within range at all times, more than likely. These are all a lot of things I think a lot of people might find really convenient. So, yeah, although they don't, you know, they don't always think of this stuff. If this is an idea you think the world could use, please help us uh, fund the uh, remote control wheelchair attachment. It's a much more affordable option to the full priced remote control wheelchair that are sold. And how much do those run exactly? They run about 14000 and this device could easily go for a few hundred dollars, not more than three or four. So we hope to make a difference and we hope to get your help. Thank you so much. And there you go. Ta-da!